Hi, welcome to Joe's Metal Woodworking Adventures. Here we are on ploughed land. We're trying out a new machine today. We're doing a test on it. It's the Gauze MD. It's a Mars search aid company in the Ukraine. This particular machine is their first machine they brought out. And it's sturdily made, sturdily made at the top with carbofiber bottom stem. The features on this are, 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 I really like are which are where you can just tie it up with a lever, which is brilliant. And that's the company Mars. And this is their search head, which is the Tiger. It's a waterproof machine which goes in the water, which is brilliant. So it does all really nice quality. And it's got the device, which is just put in your pocket, switch on, and you've got four different radio waves. So that if you get any interference, you can move it, you can move it away from a different machines' interference, which is great. So I'm going to test it all out now, see what it's like. Report later. The good thing about this, the good thing about this machine, it goes fast as you want. Fantastic speed recovery, absolutely brilliant. Look, got another 81. Really loud is, is the sound, it's a cracking sound. No mistaking it. Oh, oh, can't wheel penny. <laughs> ah, can't wheel penny. From there. Oh, blimey. Size of that. Yeah, George the third, can't wheel penny. A buckle. 18th century, buckle. Pottery rim, pot rim, I think. Quite large. Or a basin, don't know, but it's... Could be plated, I'm not sure, so it'll be plated. Yeah, it's one of the big buttons. 17th century, 18th century, definitely. The highest calibre for the muskets. That's huge! And uh, yes, that would definitely blast your hand off, I think, and, and your leg off, and everything. And that could be nice and proper, that right, probably in half. It's huge. And that was um, 67 on the uh, SMD and Roman. Well, look at that. Well, have a bit of that. Hey! -hey. Very nice. I don't know who it is, but we'll have the Roman. And a Roman. I'm happy with that. <laughs> it's only a Roman bronze, but we're getting close to Romans. <laughs> with the, uh, the Gauze MD. Yeah, well, that's okay. I'm at next. <laughs> happy with a bit of Roman. And what have you found? Victoria's Threatening Beach. Oh, nice. Let's have a look then. Oh, bit of silver. Oh, I like to see a bit of silver again. Oh, yes. Oh, what's the date of that then? 1877. Oh, right. What's well, on a silver today? Very good. Oh, side. yeah, it's upside down. We have to prize it open. something off a uh, tractor, maybe, copper bin. It's a coin. Anyway, right in the edge there with the Gooks MD, and that was 83. So here we go. Oh, it's not a coin. Oh, it's a uh, 
uh, be medieval um, horse harness. Horse harness. Brass. All to a joke. Probably 18th century. Coke at 66, but it makes a right blippy noise on the coke, so that's good. Blippy noise on coke, that's what we want, so recognise that for next time. Oh, oh, there we go, ahaha! Oh yes, it's a spindle wheel, medieval spindle wheel, boys and girls. Yes, that's all right. Probably Roman, because it's blank. Blank, Roman, I think. Yep. Blank, Roman, spindle wheel. There you go. I think it's a cuff link, personally, but uh, it's nice and fancy, that, isn't it? Cuff link, right? So, cuff link. Just found a button there with some pattern on. So, um, not quite sure who it is, uh, but I think it's I probably I think it's a, a military button. But we'll wash it wash it off and clean it all up and show you later. Oh, there you go. We found it. It's a penny. Oh, it's a penny of somebody. Who is it? 18th century. Probably uh, some sort of jar or something. All nicely patterned. So, gotta be something on this field. Just found a button so far. Haha, right. uh -huh, 70. 73 with this. I'm not sure what this is, uh, but it's so fancy patterned. That'd be a token of some kind. It's lead though. Uh, investigate later. A larger musket shot. Sixteenth, seventeenth century. It was. Oh ho! Dig that treasure! Oh yeah, dig that treasure! Just here. Oh. <laughs> oh, we got a nice hammer there. Look at that. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We've got an hammer. Oh, look at that. Crack it. Absolutely bent. Yes, we'll have a bit of that. Oh, is it? I think it's Elizabeth. Elizabeth the first. Groot. This is the Groat, Groat, and that's with 72 on the gorse. <laughs> Woo, brilliant. Ha, <laughs> Amen. Excellent. Absolutely superb. A Groat. In great condition as well. Eh? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Brilliant. Happy to see with the new machine. Very lucky, because I've been at it all day, but there you go. Look at that. Eh, Elizabeth the first. Groat. I can't check the date later and, and clean it all up for you. Whoa! Happy or what?
not sure what it says actually but there yeah it's a badge car badge of some kind <laughs> oh.